Hi friends, welcome back to Fun Learning. Let's get started with the Science Olympiad preparation for Grade 1. Here we are going to focus on the logical reasoning portion which is the first section of their paper. So let's get started with this section. Our first question reads, There is a certain relationship between the pair of figures given on either side of the four dots that is given on either side of these four dots this and this identify the relationship of given pair and find the missing figure that is this do you want to try out by guessing which would be the correct answer well while you try let me start beginning to explain this now what we have been given is a bird and a nest. The relationship is that the bird lives in a nest. So if bird is to nest, so the fish is to what? Well, fish lives in a pond. So the correct answer is option A. Let's go to the next question. The next question says, Trishu is sleeping in the dash. Option A, morning, B, evening, C, afternoon and D, night. You can get this one. Now let's look at Trishu's window. What do we see? We see the moons and stars. And when do the moons and stars come? They appear at night. So Trishu is sleeping in the night. So our option is option D. Going to the next question is question number 3 which says complete the figure pattern. So let's look at this figure pattern. It's something like this. If you observe carefully kids, you can get the answer. Have you got the answer? Well, let's look at solving it together. The figure, if you see the first block is actually nothing but the option A. The second block which is the yellow square with the orange circle inside is the option D. The third block with the green block and yellow circle inside is the option B. So the remaining block that will complete the figure is option C. So that's our answer. Next question is there are dash equal groups of cats. So here we have a number of cats. We have got to count the number of groups that have four cats. How can we do that? Do you want to try? Pause the video and try to solve. While I go to explain to you. Now when you have such questions, cancel out four cats and number that group. For example, let's cancel out our first group. The second four gives us the second group. Third four cats give us the four third group. The next four, the fourth group, fifth group and six groups. So our answer is option A. Six equal groups of four cats. Next question is, Select the odd one out amongst the diamond, square, circle and triangle. Have you chosen your answer? I think you've got it right. Yes, it's option C. But why? You have your reason? I have mine. Because circle has no corners while all other figures have corners. You see this? That's why the odd one out is option C. Coming to sixth question. Choose the correct option to replace the question mark in the given figure series. This is our figure series. If you look carefully, these are the figure series and we have to find what is this question mark. Why don't you try? So you've chosen your answer, now let's match it. If you look at this pattern, reducing 6 by 1 
and the same for 3 and 2. So both of these are reducing by number 1. So if we continue this pattern, so 6 is reduced by number 1, then from 5 it gets reduced to number 1 and from here it should again get reduced to number 1 to get to 3. So 6 minus 1 is 5, 5 minus 1 is 4, 4 minus 1 is 3 and 3 minus 1 is 2. So our answer 4 sits correct. Question number 7. Now if this figure is to this figure, then this figure is to what? Try this. Now let's go to see the explanation. So this figure which is a triangle inside a square is to so what is happening? That the figures in the first image are getting interchange in terms of the one that is inside comes outside and the figure that is outside goes inside. So if figure with the triangle inside the square is to a square inside the triangle, then this figure with the rectangle inside the circle should be the rectangle outside with circle inside which if you look at these options is option number D. Next question is which pattern comes next? So let's look at our patterns. You can try this out first and then I'll give you the tip. So Whenever you have this series of patterns, always identify the first figure and where does this first pattern repeat itself. So you can make sure that wherever it repeats, just before that, this pattern sequence ends. So this is pattern sequence 1 and the second pattern sequence is third. So the third sequence that will begin will begin with the triangle and then with the circle. So that is why your answer is answer option A. Let's look at another such question of which pattern comes first. Now these are the given figures and we need to find the next figure. So as I told you, the trick is to identify the first figure and find out where does it appear next. So then you know that this is one pattern. So person with the red cap followed with the starred cap. So our answer is option B. Next question is which item is the heaviest? So you'll get these questions, so carefully see the figures and understand. Is it the stapler? Is it the brick? Is it the pen? Or the tablet? Well, stapler you can carry easily with single hand. So is the case with the pen and with the tablet. But not the brick. So the heaviest is the brick. Let's look at another such question. Which of the following is the heaviest? Is it the car? Is it the cycle? The bus? Or the motorbike? Kids, here you should try to picture and notice the very simple rule that one that is the biggest would be the heaviest. So of these, the biggest vehicle is the bus. So our answer is option C. Let's look at the next question. Which figure fits the missing part? For these questions, an easy way to approach this is draw the figure in the empty space. So as I draw, I get a triangle and this shape matches my option B. So my correct answer is option B. So kids, 
This was how we solved the logical reasoning section. I hope you enjoyed it and also got most of your answers correct. Look out for our next video for looking at the next section for grade 1 which is the science section. Do like and subscribe to this channel so that we are connected always. Till we meet again, take care.